Hey gang, Tony here. Uh, back fresh from some yard sailing. Uh, this has been a weird weekend. I didn't go out again on Friday because I... Honestly, I'm just not really feeling it this year that much. Um, so yeah, I, I slept in. I said fuck it. But uh, I went out today with my brother, and again, it is like a slow, slow morning. We actually didn't hit any yard sales at all. And then luckily found there was a rummage sale and a flea market, both like church uh, type things. So that's kind of cool because there's a lot of stuff all in one place and you don't have to drive around as much. I got most of my stuff from the one rummage sale. They had a, uh, they had like this, I don't know how to, as a, as a, la. Okay. I'm going to talk now, and words will come out of my mouth that actually make sense. This is how you make a good YouTube video, by making words form sentences that are coherent and thoughtful. That was they tell me anyway, I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes I can make a whole video, and I'll probably only get like one thumbs down from that one person that thumbs down stuff. I don't know. Okay, so... There was a bunch of paper bags, and we were looking around, Mike and I, and they said, oh, take a paper bag, fill it up, it's a dollar. All right, okay. So, I filled up a paper bag with stuff. Uh, this is what I got. There was an Omega Man VHS clamshell that... When someone tells you to fill up a bag and they're going to charge you one dollar for that bag, you kind of start putting stuff in the bag that you maybe wouldn't have normally bought. Um, not to say that I wouldn't have normally gotten this. I probably would have paid a dollar for just this, but it's pretty cool. Omega Man. Hey, man. Hey, man, Omega Man. And one other VHS tape, I also got Halloween 3 Season of the Witch, which I do have on Blu-ray. But VHS? I don't know. I don't know why. Because it's a dollar bag. Because dollar bag. Got some DVDs. Again, you know, it's just like, eh, why not? An Amer American Haunting. Donnie Darko, which upon further reflection, I'm pretty sure I already have. I, I think. I'm almost positive I already have this. Uh, knocked Up. Why not? It's a good movie. I like the movie. I'm just... I wouldn't have necessarily added it to my collection. Garden State, again, you know, I like the movie. Um, why not? All right, so those are the movies that I got. And then I also found some video games that I would never have purchased. And I basically only, again, because it was a dollar bag, so these are basically all up for trades or whatever because I don't want them. I have no use for them. I don't have a PlayStation 2. They're all PlayStation 2 games. So, trades. Anyone? We got, um, I don't know, some Dance Dance Revolution game. These are all in pretty good shape uh, and complete as well. So, I mean, that's something, right? I don't know. Dance Dance Revolution, uh, Disney Sing It. I feel like most of these games need something too, probably. I, I'm not really sure. You, if you know, you know. I, I don't know. High School Musical, Sing It. I'm assuming this is like a one of those, you know, you need a microphone or something. I don't know. Dance Dance Revolution Supernova. And Kim Possible. What's the switch? dollar bag. I blame the dollar bag. So these are all I do I do not want these. Please someone take them from me. Give me a, anything. I don't care. I will send these to you. Uh hit me up. <laughs> all right, so that was that. And then I did get also Super Monkey Ball for GameCube, which I think I have already. I think I have that. I'm not really sure. It's complete, which is rare these days. 
I don't know if it's really rare, but whatever. And then I got another GameCube game, which on the front says Superman Shadow of Apocalypse, and then on the inside is actually Freak Style. So that is a mismatch incomplete, whatever you want to say. And that was everything that I put in my dollar bag. And then I paid an extra dollar for a GameCube. <laughs> it doesn't have any controllers, it doesn't have any hookups, no power cord, no AV cord. Um, and I'll tell you why I bought this. For First of all, it was a dollar, so what the fuck? Who cares? Second reason, Super Monkey Ball, the game, was in there. So... I got the case in the dollar bag, and then I got the game in here, which, you know, I could have told them, hey, the game's in this, but I also wanted this memory card that was in there. So I, I kind of bought it for the game, kind of bought it for the memory card, kind of bought it because I needed one of these pieces, that right there, because I have um, Game Boy players hooked up to the bottom of my other game cubes, so I wanted a spare one of those. And then I tested it and it actually works. So now I'm thinking that I'll keep it all together and maybe... Does anyone need a GameCube? I apparently... I just realized I have four GameCubes. I don't know why. I just never sold any of them yet. Um, I don't know that I have all the hookups for them, but if you need just a GameCube... I don't know why I'm doing this. My yard sale videos are turning into, like, trade sale videos. I don't want to... I don't mean to do that. I'm sorry, guys. I apologize for that. I just have been getting a lot of stuff that I'm not really uh, planning on keeping. I don't know. I'll, I'll figure it out myself. Don't worry about it. Forget it. Ignore me. I went to one other yard sale. Well, no, I hit a couple other yard sales. But at one yard sale, I got the... PlayStation 1 Namco light gun and I got the hangover on Blu-ray Blu-ray hangover put that with the movies and I also got Final Fantasy 8 for please PlayStation 1 which was a pretty good score, I suppose. Uh, all complete, looks good. Got got all the discs, got all the manuals. I have never really played any of the Final Fantasy games. I know, I know. If you can tell me, do you need to play them like in order, or like is there a story that you need to follow, or can I just play Part Eight and it'll make sense? I I don't know. I've never played any of them. So, I was thinking about playing this, if I can, like, without being completely lost. So, let me know. I'm sure you guys know better than I do. That's everything, guys. Not a very good weekend. Um, I mean, I got a bunch of stuff for, like, I think I spent, like, $4 or something. But, uh, maybe 5 bucks. But it's, like, a lot of, kind of, a lot of stuff I was, I'm not gonna keep, I guess. Um, I'm gonna go, because I'm just sucking the energy out of your souls right now. I could tell. I feel it. I know I'm doing it, so I'm gonna go. <laughs> Breathe deep at night, everybody. Hope you're having a good weekend. Bye.